So today I'm going to be doing my November favourites, which is actually really consistent of me because usually I forget to do my favourite videos, but today I'm doing it. It's like my second time in a row, so... Okay, so my first favourite is this Maybelline New York Colour Show Brocades Collection Nail Polish. Um, it's in the colour Knitted Gold and it's just amazing. It's so sparkly and so festive and it's just perfect for this time of year. Um, I think it was like $2.99 or $3.99, something like that. But I do know it is limited edition so if you do want to get this nail polish, do go out and get it pretty soon because I know um, they're pretty ruthless with their limited edition stuff. Like it's in and then it's out. I think it's still in. And I got mine from Superdrug, so you can go check that out. It's super sparkly. Next up is this Honey Mania set from the Body Shop. This is the Bubble Bath Melt, and put it in your bath, and then it melts, and it's so gorgeous. It smells just like honey. I've been super stressed this month, and this is just something so lovely to look forward to, like at the end of the week, to just have a bubble bath and relax. I love it. And this is the uh, body butter that goes with the bath bath melt I can't talk today um, <laughs> and this is what the body butter looks like and it smells just like honey and these are actually a birthday present from my sister I have no idea how much they were and unfortunately they're not in shops anymore because it was a limited edition for like the autumn season in body shop and now they have all their Christmassy stuff like they have like gingerbread stuff and cranberry stuff when I went in the other day I just popped in for a second I didn't really see these they might still be there so go check it out but if you love the smell of honey you'll love this it's so gorgeous and just something lovely to relax and like have your bubble bath then after just moisturize yourself mm. my next favorite is this Viviana smoked vanilla richly scented candle I actually got this for my birthday as well for my best friend but I haven't been able to use any of my birthday presents until like November time because my birthday was at the beginning of October but um, I've been so busy I literally don't get to use any of my things it just... Ah. But anywho, I recently started lighting this candle and it's so perfect. It's everything I want in a candle. It's sweet, yet smoky and musky and just, oh, just lovely. It's so cozy for this time of year. So this is the actual box, what it comes in. I'll probably keep this box afterwards and use it like for storage, like jewelry or like makeup or something like that. Um, but this is what the actual candle looks like. It's like mirrored and it's really pretty just sitting on your table. The scent does carry across your room. I really don't like candles that say they're scented and you smell them and they're scented and then when you burn them, nothing comes out and your room still smells the same. I have no idea where my best friend got it, but if you just search for like a Viviana smoked vanilla richly scented candle, I'm sure you'll find it. Oh my gosh, if you want to see my candle collection, make sure you comment below because I have a huge candle collection. Well, not that huge, but quite big but not huge. Okay, so my next favorite is a clothing item. These tartan trousers that I got from Zara. I got these um, back in October. I love these. These are so on trend and I'm not usually one to go like crazy for trends or anything like that. I just usually wear whatever I want to wear. But this trend I am actually all about, the tartan trend. I think the tartan trend is absolutely gorgeous but it has to be the right print of tartan. Because when I was actually looking for tartan trousers, so I went to Topshop and I saw like some tartan leggings in there and they looked kind of cheap. They were like 25 pounds, but they look so cheap, like they should have been like seven pounds. Yeah, I found these for the exact same price. Oh my gosh, Zara always gets it right. Like it's a sort of like a stretchy material, like lycra sort of feel, not quite. It's just a nice thick material and it's just perfect for this time of year and just right on trend. Um, When I was getting these, this lady saw me like holding them and she was like, where did you get those? And I was like, oh there, she's like, thank you. And like ran off and like looked for her size and I was actually shopping with some friends and in London one of the Oxford Street Zara shops and one of my friends was like is it okay if I get those and I was like sure I don't mind as long as we don't wear them at the same time I'll probably do like a blog post with them or like a lookbook my next favorite is from Zimbabwe it's the smooth peanut butter 
nutty and healthy. And it does not get any more natural, it does not get any more organic or healthy than this stuff because they don't add anything to it. And you can taste the difference because even the organic peanut butters I get here in the supermarket, they taste a little bit bland. Like they, I think they like water them down or something. I don't know, but they don't really taste that nutty. This tastes so strong and so nutty, like actual nuts have just been thrown in there like just oh the taste is gorgeous and my mom always cooks with peanut butter like I don't know if anybody else I don't know if it's like a Zimbabwean thing we, we always have peanut butter in like all our foods like foods you wouldn't expect to have peanut butter in them they have peanut butter in it them. My next favourite is a song and it's the song by Storm Queen, Look Right Through and it's such a party tune, I love it, it's like yeah, ow. It's a great workout song as well, like ow, it's like a party. I need to stop. The video is a bit weird, but I kind of like it. Um, so yeah, that's my favorite song at the moment. My next favorite is actually an advert. I don't know if you guys know, but this time of year, all of the shops sort of compete to have the best advert. A lot of them have been doing really well. Usually my favorite is John Lewis, but I don't know why. I really like the John Lewis advert, but it wasn't my favorite. I think it's the song, like I preferred Ellie Goulding's song last year, or was it the year before? You know, the Ellie Goulding cover of um, Elton John's song? your song. I also love the Tesco adverts, like they're really lovely, they're like home videos. But my favourite advert was a Marks and Spencer advert which is, what is it called? Dorothy. You know Dorothy? With the, the, the like sparkly red shoes? The Wizard of Oz. It's like a Wizard of Oz theme and it has Helena Bonham Carter, you know the lady in Harry Potter, Alice in Wonderland, everything. She is everything. Basically on that basis alone, because Helena is in it, it made me just love the advert a little bit more and you can tell they put so much effort into the advert like I'm such an advert freak like I analyze them and I'm like okay is this one better is that one better so I'm just I'm weird like that so yeah the Marks and Spencer's advert wins for me the link to that will be down below and my last favorite which is also an advert which is by Turkish Airlines it has Kobe Bryant and Leo Messi in it basically traveling the world trying to one-up each other with selfies I mean it does not get more current than that how fun would it be to play that game and actually try and one-up your friends with selfies? If I ever get to like take a gap here and go traveling, my one thing would be to go around the world one-upping someone with selfies like, oh, I'm in front of like the Eiffel Tower or I'm in front of this or look at this giant burger I'm taking a selfie with. So yeah, basically an advert really makes me want to go on holiday. So yeah, go check out that advert. It's so much fun. Uh, like the last few years, adverts have been stepping up their game and being awesome. So yeah, make sure you go check that advert out. The link will be down below. So yeah, guys, those are my November favorites. I hope you had an awesome month. I hope you're happy, I hope you're healthy, and all that good stuff. It's almost Christmas, guys. We're almost there. We're almost there. Anyway, guys, I'll see you later. Stay healthy. Bye.